and making text like this can be challenging in Capcom Mobile, but it's not. Writing CapCut and moving straight away to our text, and then we put in our first text, which is animating, and we have animating already here. So we'll just set it at the middle of our screen. As you can see, we we'll make it also last in text, and then from there we'll be setting an animation for it, which I like the concentrates like we used in the first one. So then I'll be setting a key from here and another one. It's close to it so that it can make that fast. So but we're gonna be using the graph and I think this cubic is is also very very good. You can also use quadis. So we add in our next text and that next text is actually text. So, well, I don't want it to be capital later, so that's why we're using it again. Like so, we have that, and certain animation for it, and I like it to just pop up. So, immediately animate it, moving to the left, it pops into the same, and just like that. So, um, we'll make it to fit in travel timeline but then setting it we'll have to do that so that it's actually going to just show um, in between the keyframe so as animating is moving we are seeing our text popping up and so like that, that that's good now so we just have to make a little arrangement and yes so that's I'll be changing the color to black and yes that's it so let's see how that goes okay beautiful then we'll actually come up to placing our next text and placing our next text and our next text is supposed to be like like and for like I'll be using the moon italic just like we used in the first one and I'll change this color to white actually and from there there's an animation for it but I like this blur for it so blur and then I'll be setting um or making the carrot that we saw in the first one tools up here here so we have that carrot still on white then we'll try to place it so it's gonna be showing underneath like just like so and we've done that so we're gonna be set an animation for it and I think also a pop-up is actually gonna be good but we can reduce its animation duration so that it's actually just gonna come up before light shows up and as you can see yes it's doing that and we have of a text now that that book but I don't really like it so that's I'm gonna be changing it I think this showing up is actually gonna look more calm but we now have to change something here in the keyframe expand it a little to actually make that gentle um, so that you know, yeah friendly in the eyes of the viewers and also like that um, yeah then we move the animation to that and so it will be more than our graph cubic is we can use quad is as I said before so now we have to just make sure that everything aligns it's both so it's at a Yes, I think I like the way this one showing up and then we position light to where it's supposed to be and then we position the current just underneath like and then we move to our next text and our next text is actually gonna be this yes this and I'd like it to be in the 
as you can see our first two text animation and text were actually in the system format but now now we'll see is pop-ins here and then for this we'll be using the animation type one So we have to export that. So then we will now back and we'll have to delete all these ones. Delete each and every one of them. Now that's one thing with Cap Mobile because it doesn't really have the compound clip. So we just have to do export and then we we create an overlay with it. And I think I would also like to call that import. So now you can find that I'm not using CapCut Pro, so I'm going to be cutting up that section of CapCut. So you won't actually be showing, giving me double reflection. So it's just actually going to show once, and then where I've got some everything showing, I have to set the keyframe again, and then move it up like so, so that it's aligned very well. And then oops, also use the cubic ease. So everything is actually well. Then on the third, we added our next text. And the next text is supposed to be Karen. And Karen, we then said we can just on the HIRs. And from there, I'll be given to the information type one. And type one, just like we did the first one. Sense this. Please do ensure that you actually do this so that it won't be while you're still working. So animations are going to be except you just want to like want them to go. So you can also see now we already have an E here, just like I said, explaining what I did. So we have E and then we also use type to make it all in place and apply okay. this to and so what we can just put it here add in our next text which is chilling chilling there and put chilling and out like to use the blow size and setting the G right like on the end of can something like so so but we have to reduce the animation duration and I think 0.3 seconds actually well and we put in our next text next text is supposed to be I and in so but in I have to use my phone it like just the moly regular and that's that so we decrease it as you can see and we'll begin to animate in it and from there we're actually gonna be using I want it to actually slide in like slide in but this wide right is not giving me what I want so I like the slide right it's actually working well so the next thing is I'll make it CapCut so CapCut Mobile actually so type CapCut Mobile and see put between the emoji you just have to remove all the space there set the middle and you change the regular to Also be giving it the concentrate animation and reduce it to like 7.4 sec and then we're moving up to our next word which is birds but but b u t birds and then yes but 
and moving. Having that animation, I think the flow is also going to be wrong too, because it's like conjunction, we will want say next. So 0 0.3 sec is actually going to be good for it. And then I would like to increase it to give it that bold, big look. Setting on the key has to be increasing. And yes, so it covers the bottom section so well. Just like we done with that, we'll be placing the next test. And that should be it. So, with that, we have it and the different fonts to be in italic and set it on the limits and make sure. text which is not and and more nuts and then I'll add in a full stop to that and the next thing is I think I'll still like to leave it up I'll just change its color to black um increase its size yes increase its size and then place it just line it so it fits well, and let's set its animation. I think I also like it to have that animation flow. So 0.5 seconds I think good for it. And so that's it. That's how we made the animation. This animation. So go to subscribe and God bless you.